Hi, welcome to my home. Here's two of the turtles that lived in one of the Seagate filters ponds. I'm going to put them back in the pond now. Um, we used to have a pond before Seagate filters came in and installed one of their ponds in our home. This pond here is about um, 900 gallons of water and um, we only have to take care of it once a month, but being in a homeowners association, we had a lot of problems with um, HOA rules and violations for appearance, the way it looked. So Seagate Filters and us sat down and we had a dog house that we have right here, and we put a pump system inside the house, um, and so people would be able to see it. On the cedar dog house that we got from a local pet store and modified it. I put three screws up here, and I took the nuts out and lift it up like this. You set this to the side, and here's the bio system. This is an extreme biofiltering system. This is the pump. This is where the water pumps into the filtration like the full pump system. This is the for the light system, for the Malibu lights that we have set around the pond and inside. Um, we also have the option um, to put a UV system in it, but I chose not to do it because um, I don't have a lot of problems with allergies. This is the tube we use to um, backwash the system. You take the tube and you take it like this. It's real easy. You just screw it in like so. You can take it and lay it right there in the yard. The backwash runs right out into the yard. I'm going to take the lever here. I have filter, I have erratic, and I have backwash. I turn the lever to the right all the way around to backwash. Then it pumps the bottom of the pond's fluid backwashes the biomedia inside, goes out this tube, and it goes right out into the yard. No smell. Before you backwash the pond system, you shut the power off of the pump by unplugging it or a switch, whatever you have. When you unplug it, you lay the plug here, and you take the strainer that's inside here, you turn it like so, you lift it up, and the reason you do this once a month you might have to do it twice in the fall because of the plants. It'll suck up a lot of material in here. You just take it out in your yard or whatever. You dump it down. You slide it right back inside. You might have to prime it. You get some water out of the pond and you pour some water in it. Or you don't even have to use that. You can use regular house water. Take the top, put it back on, turn it so it's locked in place. Take the plug. Plug it back in, it'll prime itself, and then the water starts coming out of the system. It takes less than two minutes, and I only do this once a month. There you have it. You have the biofilter, extreme filtration system. You have the pump station, you have the pond. The pond and the filtration station, the pump station is, it works very great. It's only 27 inches wide, 30 inches long. Very compact.